Oh shit. Okay. I'm really doing it. God. Hey YouTube. <laughs> I am I am so nervous. Okay. This is my first time trying to talk in person in front of the camera. And I always do voiceover, so this is going to be a little bumpy, but I hope you guys accept me as what I am. It's going to be weird, but alright, let's let's take it together. <laughs> So today I wanted to talk something exciting and, and I wanted to share it with my friends and my um, my other favorite YouTubers who, have been, uh, who also are following me on my channel. And uh, yes, today I'm actually going to do a uh, uh, Sephora haul. Ah, I'm lying. This bag is empty by the way. <laughs> I heard that there's a huge VIB sale. Uh, in Sephora, I, I just wanted to jump right into it and I was like, okay, this is the moment it, When you are are trying to save your money and you're waiting or expecting for the mom moment when you wanted to jump right onto the sale situation You gotta expect me to be one of those first people <laughs> Going into that sale and trying to grab the right things for the moment Anyways, wow, okay let me check what are the current offers and it's value till tomorrow. I know I'm really sorry that I'm actually doing this Sephora haul video and um, talking about the sale when it's only one more day available. But it's still not too late, my friend, it's still not too late because they have um, different offers based on if you're a beauty insider, if you're a VIP or VIP, you different statuses based on what type of member you are on Sephora. And uh, they have from 10% off to 15% off. And it's not just 15% off on the whole of your purchase, it's going to be 15% off on each product, whatever you buy. So that is really cool. And I, I didn't even know that until I went near the cash counter and this person was like, Yes, this is going to be really cool because it's not just the whole sale and then you get a 15% off in the end it's like for each product I'm guessing and um uh all right, let's jump right into it. Okay, uh, this first part I want to share is what I've been using for months now. And I try to save the most of it. Even though this is one of the expensive products, I try to use it to like small drops of it. And so that I, it could last longer for me. <laughs> and the first product I want to share is this. It's called um, Caudalie, 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 Caudalie. I don't know how you pronounce it. I'm still an international who lives in America, so you know how it is. So uh, it's I think it's called Caudalie. Caudalie Vino Perfect Serum. And it's one of the main things you have to, uh, regimen you have to do uh, when you wash your face. After you wash your face is you tone your face and you put skin serum. And in, uh, I think in Korean, I think serum in a, um, another word, it means Skin. It's basically trying to revitalize your skin, I guess. So, Cardly Vino Perfect Serum um, is one of the things that I want. I've been wanting to buy, and it has like 15 percent off. So I was like, yes, I have to get this. And this is like my third. Is this is going to be my third time getting this? And this one of the expensive one for me. So I'm actually happy that I got this. Um, Skin Laundry Hydrating Cream Face Wash. Oh God. I hope this shows in the camera. <laughs> uh, anyway, Skin Laundry Hydrating Cream Face Wash. It says that it cleanses, it hydrates your skin, it also nourishes your skin. And um, I've been tr uh, trying uh, back and forth with different types of face washes from drugstore, from uh, Walmart, any, I mean anywhere. I try to get uh, affordable face washes to the most expensive, not the most, but I think it's just expensive for me. I try to uh, juggle up and test a lot of face washes and skin products on my skin just to see which ones work the most. And uh, this is one of those... Uh, journey I'm going to try because this is one of the things which is new I've never tried it and I'll let you know in one of the future videos how this works well for me and also by the way if you guys want me to uh, make a skincare routine video please let me know and comment below in the video if you uh, want me to do a separate session of how I take care of my skin. You know, uh, another thing is it's very ideal for normal to dry skin, it says. And um, I, I am more of a combination 
skin because depending on the weather and the uh, situations my skin is always always in the nor uh, like mostly normal but at the same time it could get very it could get kind of dry sometimes it also could get oily if it's very hot or sweaty you know so i think i'm just going to try and let you guys know if this is worth a buy the next thing i wanted to share is um smashbox smashbox photo finish primer sets set and see you can see right this right there it says how much it costs this it comes with two products which is uh, photo finish primer water and photo finish foundation primer which is also oil free and it helps to minimize your pore and there it comes with two products in a box and it values for $42 but uh, it came up to 25 and then there's also an extra 15% discount on this and I found this product in the aisle where, where they have a bunch of mini traveling sizes and mini very small products I think it's like their um, attraction spot where when while people are waiting in line they have a bunch of products in front of them so if they like to grab onto it um, 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 I didn't I wasn't even waiting in line but I like looking at small travel size products so that when I'm going on traveling or trips I like to have smaller products which I could use and which is also compact and it comes very handy so this was one of the best buys for me and I definitely want a primer or something to coat before uh, onto my face before I apply a foundation or anything so I think this was a good buy and it comes with one full size of the primer water and it also comes with a travel size of primer found foundation primer oh, okay <laughs> um, all right and um, next thing is Yes, Urban Decay. This is another product I found near the aisle. Seriously guys, believe me, I wasn't even waiting in line, but I always look for smaller products if I'm trying them for the first time. Uh, I always, I never go for like big, uh, bulky products if, if that's my first time to try, try out. I always try to go for like smaller trial pack, trial size travel size products so this was one of the things I wanted to try because I uh, I always do makeup but uh, I never have a setting spray to finish off my whole look and let it stay on for a whole day I just wanted to get uh, a setting spray just to see how that works and so I could also uh, suggest people who are really very active and who also want to look very you know put together with all the makeup and so they have two different sprays, now I get it. So one of them is a setting spray, the other one is a primer spray. Which I'm guessing I already have one, but why not try another one, you know? <laughs> and, <coughs> and it has two products, just like this one. So I'm, I'm actually glad I got this one as well. There's another one from NARS. This is also from the aisle I got. Seriously, aisle is the best place to look for <coughs> look for something something interesting, which has two things in one. You know, you don't just go uh, in the um, se actual sections and buy oh this is a big blush or big bronzer or big uh, compact powder. Instead, you go to aisle. They have like the, uh, two things in one, two uh, two items and put together in one box, and the prices will be. Half, half price of the original price so that is much much useful for me I guess so I happen to find this NARS blush bronzer duo hmm. and uh, it's it's like a good size of my palm if you see so I wanted to try and have this if you notice this has two colors blush and a bronzer but I think I could um, I don't know if it show. It looks way lighter than what it is. Look, it, it seems to be for me. It's very mild, but I would like to use this for like a everyday purpose. I think I wanted to try something new. Um, so I'll let you guys know, or maybe I could use this for um, for an upcoming 
makeup look or a tutorial or something and I'll, I'll see how that goes hope it's worth a buy all right let's move on to the hair stuff hair is something that I'm, I'm, I'm I always care as well apart from my skin so and since you all know I have colored my hair recently with a lot of streaks and shit so I wanted to shit oh shit I, I just said that word so many times right now I don't know if I'm allowed to say that on YouTube help it's just cool I don't know anyways um all right so the next product I wanted to say I wanted to share is this uh, Moroccan oil pure argan oil what yes this can be used uh, for your for your skin hands and also to, uh, and also to your hair to your nails it, it helps to condition your skin nails and hair and I uh, love organ oil and I've been using organ oil every every day I use different types of oils by the way but uh, organ oil is something which which works for your skin your your whole body basically just like coconut oil I think so I wanted to get this beauty this beauty <laughs> this beauty um, so I could try on for my hair and I I always every day every now and then I don't just um, um, just oil up my hair just before I wash my hair or something or the day before I wash my hair I always put a little bit of oil rub it in my palm and I put it in the end of my hair just so that I could secure the ends so that's not the only thing I use it for I just use it on my hands so my hands don't get dry on my cuticles as you see my cuticles are like kind of darker so I like this product I wanted to try this product I always wanted to, I've been wanting to try this product let's just say that <laughs> um, but I always try to go for a cheaper um, more affordable organ oil and all of them are they come up to like this size very small size or like about this size and this is go they get over so soon and I want to get something that's kind of straight to wavy so the texture is very I want a very lighter texture oil and this oil is it ha it's a light pure organ oil so it has a lighter texture to hold at the same time it kind of moisturizes your end so I wanted to get this and try it on and I'll let you know how this is this works as well Seriously guys, check this out and if you're into oils, this is one of the things you definitely need in your daily life. And I'll be glad if someone else wanted to get get this or not even this brand. If you wanted to even get any affordable oil, start off with affordable oil and then move on to um, um, a more fancier one, go on for it. But it's one of the oils which is very much if you're trying to grow your hair, if you're trying to take care of your skin. This is one of the main things you need to see what they have. So that's what I went for. And um, and I got these caviar anti-aging color hold, color hold shampoo and conditioner. And they are basically for color treated hair. And they're free of parabens, sulfates, and synthetic color. And uh, this should, I think... I need to give it a try and I will let you guys know how this works but so far I kind of had a pretty good reviews about it I've seen people using this too this is mostly like I've, I've heard about this brand much but I, I have never personally gone for it because I go to school and I spend a lot of money on my tuition so I, I always go for a drugstore shampoo and conditioner even they seem to be expensive but the Sephora sale, you guys spoil me so much that <laughs> the first thing I wanted to get was this. And along with that, I also tried to get a serum, which is called Color Hold Vibrancy Serum Dual Use Booster. Yeah. Okay, this is also for a color treated hair, and it says it's a hair serum, which I wanted to jump onto, and I have to try this as well. But I, when I tried it in the store, the consistency was not too thick not too thin it was perfect and it felt just right but you, you never know you know the things you try in the store like you try to try on a foundation in the store it looks all perfect and you come home and you try the foundation it doesn't it doesn't seem right and you'll be like you look like ugh. 
what a waste of money, you know, so... I have to try it on. I'll, I'll definitely let you guys know how this works for a color treated, color hair, colored hair. Next thing I got was a bumble and bumble. <laughs> um, just another first time I'm using this. Anyone who's thinking about coloring your hair, let's just say that <laughs> you have to get used to dealing with spending extra money on saving that colored hair you know so i want to save this color i've never gone this real light on my hair and this is my first time so i want the worth of the money i spent on this using this so um i'm you i'm the next product i got was bumble and bumble surf spray salt enriched for sexy windswept beachy texture okay whatever that is and I wanted a texture spray uh, but whenever I want to style my hair or something I think I, I'm hoping this would help so I wanted to get this product you better work you better work for me Um, another, I'll just call it BB. Um, BB hairdressers invisible oil. Because if not, I'm going to just put a picture somewhere around this side or this side so you guys could see what it is. And this one, I've heard a lot of reviews about it and a lot of people have used it, even on other YouTube. YouTubers have used this in their videos for hair. So this is called heat or UV protective primer. This is like a pre-styler. Uh, primer oil spray oil uh, which you use before you style your hair so I have to try this on and they say that it helps to soften or detangle and deep frizz tame the flyaways of your hair which we all have <laughs> why not so I want to try this thing and see if this helps and it definitely helps for UV damaged hair so I want to try this so this is one of the main things I wanted to get and I'm glad I got it. I wanted to try and get a small version of it so I got literally a small pack because I don't usually style my hair with a lot of heat or different looks but I'm, I'm willing to do it and if, even if I'm willing to do it I want something which is ready made right there and why not I'll just I wanted to get a hairspray and this says BB Spray Demode Flexible Hold Hairspray from Bumble and Bumble again. This is this color is really pretty though. So the I think when you use the spray, it's not going to be really that strong of a hold, which I don't like it either. Anyways, so that I got. And there's two more products. Um, I am just trying to save up this product for summer. So this is one of the things that I bought for my summer, I think even spring here in California, wherever you go, it's hot. So why not? Uh, I got this Shiseido, Shiseido uh, 50 plus ultimate sun protection spray. This, I wanted to get a sun protectant for my skin because uh, believe me or not, I don't know if you could see this. Do you see this thing? Oh, you see my hand, my face? Well, you can't see on my face that much because I'm kind of wearing a foundation a little bit. But here, this happened because of the sun. We had a class field trip. We went out. We had to paint outdoors. And God knows how, how plain air painters did this. But me as an art student, one of the things you have to deal with is this, the weather. So for me, um, all we had to do was... was uh, stay uh, for a few hours out in the sun and paint the lo uh, uh, paint whatever you see on location and uh, you can't stay in the sh shade and try to do it you know so and stupid me that day I didn't have no heat protectant or I wasn't aware of the weather how hot it is going to be and I was standing right in the fr in front of the sun and it just burnt my whole face till neck and I'm a brown skin you would think I have 
have more melanin. And this is a product I wanted to try, and I tried it in the store. It felt really, it, it felt really nice on my skin. At the same time, I felt like there's like a layer on top of it, which which I hope this protects me. The, and, and it's also like a sun protection spray. Spray is even better to buy, and this is also water resistant for 80 minutes. So why not? <laughs> I like anything that is lightweight for my hair because my hair is not too thick or not too thin, it's right in the middle and I wanted to secure it and at the same time I want the same volume or even extra volume if possible so I always go for a product which is which is kind of lightweight so that it doesn't put my hair down it also says that it helps you uh, if you want to detangle your hair and it protects against heat damage or even to quickly refresh your hair so why not? And one more thing that I got was three traceless hair rings this thing is is one of those best buys you get. This is like the spring hair bands, which helps to hold your hair, but at the same time, it doesn't give no trace. The moment when you put the hair band on your hair and you remove it after a few minutes, your hair is all bent. I, I don't like that. When I'm uh, I'm going out and I've styled my hair and I don't want any any other hairband impression, I always go for this uh, type of hairband. So, okay. so I got this tiny uh, VIB Rouge Sephora Pro Mini Flawless Airbrush Brush. So this is very soft and smooth, but it's very travel pack mini highlighter. Uh, from Becca which was Becca Champagne Pop and uh, they came up with this new color one of those new highlighters I forgot the name of it it's called Opal 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 Opal, Opal. who knows anyways um, I got a mini version of that and it it kind of looks like this go come on come on I don't know if it's focusing yeah it kind of looks like that and do you see that that's the kind of highlight which you're gonna get all over if you want to so i think this will be like a good try and it could be more of a, a cool down highlight and i wanted to try it for my skin tone i was like this is literally some cool highlight for my skin uh, I, I hope <laughs> and then, anyways i got i got this and these were for 100 points so if you want to take advantage of it go ahead so this will be the last product <laughs> of my whole sephora haul and i'm pretty happy and, and, and kind of convinced that i actually did a good usage of the sale i hope i hope this haul kind of helps you guys to think about what you get in Sephora because a lot of products in Sephora is really expensive at the same time um, you could buy uh, certain things sensibly the sales representative says oh this will be good for your skin or something but honestly you guys you need to do a testing on yourself you need to check what goes right for your skin or your hair or any place you're trying on or any product you're trying you need to check if it's worth for yourself so no matter who says or what they say make sure that if you really feel you're getting you're getting it right at the moment and uh, currently the Sephora is going on with the sale and I hope if someone wants to go and buy these things from Sephora go ahead if not even if the sale is over uh, there's still one more day, uh, which is tomorrow, basically. If you guys want to take advantage of it, if you're, um, you know, I don't, I don't even want to say. If you really want to just go walk in, just check out the products, see how it goes for you. But um, I'm pretty sure it'd be worth it. And I hope this helps for someone who who's been, who probably not aware that there's a sale going on. I hope this helps for someone or even if there's no sale and if you check this uh, video after the sale has ended I hope this at least helps someone to see how to see or find the right products in Sephora I'm not saying I'm the per perfect person at the same time I kind of have been to Sephora a good few times so I know I kind of know what I'm doing with it 
So, yeah. Um, let me know how your experience have been in Sephora or what you want to do or what you want me to talk more about. Do you like these kind of things? Because <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of... I was kind of uh, skeptic if I should even talk in front of the camera because I kind of have this weird... I think I have a weird accent as being an Indian and I'm always kind of self-aware of myself that I'm speaking too much or saying some things stupid in front of the camera and the whole whole world could watch this the whole world could watch this and could make fun of me <laughs> so I was just not sure about it for so long but I think that this is how you get over your fear right so this is my way of getting over the fear with you guys with the whole world so if you if anyone out there understands me you know <laughs> You and me are like this. So, uh, alright, if you like this video, please don't forget to comment below, like, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell near the subscribe button so that you always stay in touch and be up updated with my videos. And uh, this journey, which I've started a week before, is really exciting and I can't wait. To share more with you guys and this is gonna be really cool to, uh, to share more about um, other products that I'm going to use and uh, if you know whatever it, and let me know what you think about uh, the Sephora sh uh, shopping or any other products you have bought or you could probably recommend me something for and you know anything just to try it on I'm an, and I'm open for any kind of products you tell me so let me know on the comments down below and that's it. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Thank you for spending your valuable, valuable, valuable time on me, <laughs> on me ranting and saying random stuff, which probably, I hope it, it was useful. All right. Thank you so much. Bye.